The Apple Seed, written by Tamar Cohen and illustrated by Tatiana Mozakova. One warm spring day, there was a seed resting in the soil. When the seed was watered by the rain, she swelled, and when the seed felt the warmth of the sun, she sprouted. The sprout reached for the sun and asked, where did I come from? From an apple, replied the sun. The sprout wondered what an apple was. After a few sunny days and rainy spring nights, the sprout had become a seedling. The seedling was growing many stems and many leaves. She was growing roots deep into the earth. In the earth, she met a worm. She asked the worm, what is an apple? The worm replied, an apple is juicy and sweet and wriggled away. The seedling still wondered what an apple was. One clear summer night, the seedling met a star. She asked the star, what is an apple? An apple is a gift, replied the star but the seedling still wondered what an apple was. After the hot summer, the seedling had become a little tree. Many seasons passed and the little tree often wondered what an apple was. Over time, the tree's branches grew closer to the sky. Her roots grew deeper into the earth her trunk grew thick and strong, and soon she was no longer a little tree. Many creatures visited her branches, and she would ask them, What is an apple? The bird said, An apple is heavy. The squirrel replied, An apple is crisp. But the tree still wondered, what an apple was. The following autumn, the tree's leaves turned golden and fell away as usual. When the cold winter arrived, the tree went to sleep as usual. But when the warmth of spring returned, the tree awoke to something unusual. She was covered in blossom buds and they soon began to bloom. The tree had new visitors to her blossoms. She asked them, what is an apple? The bee said, an apple is big. The hummingbird replied, an apple is red. But when the tree asked the mouse, he did not answer because he did not know. Soon the blossoms fell away and the tree began to grow small green fruits all over. As summer approached, the tree felt the fruits grow big and heavy. She felt them grow crisp and juicy. And when the summer was hot, she felt her fruits grow red and sweet. The tree was filled with joy she knew where she had come from. The tree called to the mouse, I have a gift for you. She offered him her largest, reddest fruit and said, this is an apple. The end.